Welcome back everybody. In today's episode, we're gonna be finishing up the bunk beds, rebuilding our couch, and then framing in our bathroom in the back. Let's get straight into it. another trip back to the hardware store and we're gonna get some more plywood so we can start closing in the bathroom walls. platform for the fridge is now complete for the 12 volt fridge this is also a fridge and a freezer which is really awesome and convenient but now i have to run the 12 volt line up through the back up through the walls and all the way back up front to where all the battery compartments going to be so 
So I'm making some good headway in the closet slash refrigerator area. This is where the fridge goes. I took it out so I can finish up this wall. Everything's looking good. I just have to put the shiplap up so it looks all nice and pretty. Uh, it's going to be a closet area, it's pantry, it's going to be whatever. I have to hurry up though because we have a hurricane on the way to Florida and I have less than about 10 hours to get some stuff done before it is. So the bottom bunk is all closed in, it looks really good. Um, I got the USB charger installed for all their devices, everything like that. I was gonna install a 12 volt light for each of the bunks, but I found a different solution. I'm gonna show you that now. So I found these lights on Amazon. They are completely magnetic. So this has 3M tape, so you stick it to wherever you want and it just clicks right in and these things are awesome. I mean, hopefully your bus isn't doing this as you're moving around and you can rotate them. Uh, they're completely rechargeable by a USB right here. They said it's about 20 hours of runtime and it's just a tap light with three different temperature modes. Uh, awesome solution if you don't wanna run uh, more wires throughout your bus. I'll link them down below. So that's going to wrap it up for this episode. Everything is moving along really smooth and fast now that we got all the meat and potatoes out of the way. So we rebuilt the couch, framed in the back bedroom, finished the bunk beds, framed in the bathroom itself. Now we just got to hook up the water system, which you're going to see in the next episode. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button so you can follow along. Don't miss a single part of this build because we're getting toward the final stretch right now. And it's actually getting very exciting. Uh, and also, it's my birthday, so I'm going to go celebrate. See you on the next one.